here is a poster from the Muppet movie. Oh yes, yeah, I recall this. Could you believe it? I was 25. Really, I 100 pounds lighter. Miss Piggy, <sighs> in your uh, new tell-all entitled Between 460 and, and 768 pounds, <laughs> you speak of all-night parties and <sighs> drug binges that would take place at Henson Studios. <sighs> One night, Animal overdosed on LSD and tried to rape himself until he suffered extreme blood loss. Fozzie Bear found him lying naked with none of his fur at the floor of Beaker's apartment. Beaker had been beeping for help, but nobody heard him. Nobody heard him. Nobody heard him. Over here, over there's a used condom that Big Bird once used at a sleepover party. You and Kermit recently oh. split up. Well, as you know, last year Kermit the Frog became a Scientologist. Kermit was quoted as having said, she can go live on the street like a gypsy, floozy, trollopy pig bitch. Pig bitch. Well, I hope you're happy, Kermit. Now I'm hooking at the corner of Sesame and Fraggle. I'd, I'd like to end today's session with a little tradition we have on our show. Uh, word association. Um, food. Love. Love. Food. I love my food. <laughs> Fame. The Muppet movie. Defeat. Muppets in space. Ugly. Mirror. Religion. Catholic. I'm a Catholic. Future. Come back. Well, come back. Thank you, Miss Piggy. Mirror. Your career is Come one that we will continue to watch with great fascination and oh, hesitation. Yours too! Thank you for your time. Mm. Okay, thank you. You smell so powerful. <laughs> <laughs> All right, have a... What are you doing tonight?